Hey, cheers, she is. Hi, hi. Am I in the light? Am I in the light? Am I in the light now? No, I'm in the light. Table's in the light. That's important. Am I in the light? Yes. Yeah, I'm in the light. Great. Right, right. I look like a hi- <laughs> I look like a hipster and Frank. <laughs> I was born in a country called Yugoslavia, uh, but then there was a civil war, so the country got uh, discontinued. <laughs> yeah, they just stopped making it, took it right off the shelves. <laughs> and we moved to Canada when I was very little, and because of that, you guys know that feeling when you think you're like the other kids? But then you go to your first day of elementary school and you open up your lunchbox and all the other kids have ham sandwiches and you have a cheese pita and a very strong belief that the communist days were the good old days. (laughs) I'm not a very cool person, especially when it comes to relationships. I I had a third date recently and I completely blew it. All of my friends leading up to the date were like, Anna, just be cool, okay? I was like, okay, okay, I know, I know. And my therapist was like, Anna, just be cool, okay? I was like, okay, I know, I know how to be cool, okay? But then when the third date came, I said, be my boyfriend. (laughs) Be my boyfriend, please. Oh, no, not again. Oh, I'll just play it cool. I'm just gonna zip up my sweater. Just zipping up my sweater. Oh, it's a full body sweater. Look at me, I'm a ghost. And then I unzip my sweater and he was gone. And I was like, who's the real ghost, me or him? Uh, I find that guys will tell you what they want you to do during sex, but not how they want you to do it. Recently, a guy asked me to call him daddy. So I went out on a limb and I said, daddy. He was like, oh yeah, just like that. (laughs) Briggs, it was a mistake. You know that space in between your oven and your countertop? I hate that space. You cannot look good trying to get something out of there. In that one inch space, I have lost so much of my will to live. I dropped my house keys in there the other day and I was like, okay, it's not a big deal, it's not a big deal. I'll just go in and get it, I'll go in and get it. So I reach my hand in as far as it can go, but I'm still too far. So I'm like, okay, all right. So then I tilt my head and try and get my shoulder in there, then it's starting to hurt. I'm like, all right, that's fine, that's fine. Then I just start to wiggle my fingers. Just wiggle your fingers, just wiggle your fingers as though extra fingers will somehow shoot out of my regular fingers. But it's still out of reach and eventually I'm just like, fuck it, okay, I don't need these keys. I'll just move, get new keys. <laughs> just a reminder uh, that if you like what you see here tonight, you can always follow me out after the show. <laughs> I'm looking at you. I can see us going for a long walk on the beach, 20 meters apart. <laughs> Imagine if I did that to your peen. (laughs) Just like shine my teeth on it. (laughs) You guys know the back of the head move? Do you guys know that move when a guy puts his hand at the back of your head during sex? Instead of just asking you straight up to blow on his horn doggle? You know that move? Okay, unless you're a cop making sure I don't bump my head on my way into the car, don't use that move. And if you're a lady and a guy uses that move on you, next time just put your hand at the back of his head at the exact same time. So you're both just like... Give in! you're just locked in like that for hours because it's a gosh darn standoff and then you you see lights flashing and a cop car pulls up whoop 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 
uh, we have a 1084 on our hands. Straight white male doesn't want to go down on ladies because he says his tongue is too small. Uh, sir, we're going to need you to drop that hand and go down on your gal, and not just because you want her to do it back to you, but because you freaking love being all up in that puss. <laughs> Over and in and out. <laughs> uh, thanks so much, guys. I've been Anna Marie.